Hello and welcome to an all new Comic Corner. I'm as always Steven. Now today is the video that was supposed to go out last week. However, um, I forgot. Oh no, um, it took and messed up when I was uploading it. So I left a little 30 second message saying. I was trying to fix it. I was unable to get it to work. So, I'm redoing it. Anyway, let's begin. These are in no particular order. Because I've already been through them once. Anyway. Buffy the Last Slayer 1. Now, you're going to notice I have several copies of this. And I don't know how I got several copies. I know I only ordered, like, a couple. But... This is from Black Kate. And since they went to, well, they got rid of their storefront, I've had some mess ups with my uh, stuff. So, I don't know what, what, what's happening. But when I was there this week, I had, and you won't see it here, I picked up. Uh, Deja Thoris statue, I got Sherry for her birthday, um, so that came in, and, um, I forgot this week's, well they didn't have them there, the invoice I had paid for and I had said I was going to get, but, um, Anyway, I was talking to Ben, the owner, and he said they got all the bugs out, so there should be no more mess-ups from here on out. So, anything I'm missing, other than this past invoice, I think there's 14 comics I paid for and didn't get. I'm just gonna write off as a loss, start anew, and hope they don't fuck up anymore. Um, I'm just trying to give them as many chances as possible. They have one of my books out on in CGC. Um, I'm waiting to get back. Plus, um, they were kind to my old lady the first time we went there. So, no matter how bad they fuck up, they're going to have a customer for life. Even if I only buy one comic a month from there. Hoping that they don't mess that shit up. Anyway, that's my little rant for Black Gate. I really hope they do better. Because I want them to. They... And I don't know if I'm the only one having problems with them. Maybe I am. Because any all the reviews I see online say they're amazing. And they were. For a while. Until they... Went to all online sales. But, that's just my opinion. And, like I said, I'm sticking with them. No matter what, because I'm brain dead. Unholy. Uh, a love story. Issue 1. This is the Shannon Mare uh, copy. I like his artwork. I think Sherry's starting to like his artwork, so she'll probably end up with... That copy, also. Vampirilla and Dracula Unholy, number one, Perilla. Sheena, um, Queen of the Jungle, number two, Perilla. Vengeance of Vampirilla, number 25. Buffy the Vampire Slayer, number... 33. I think I got most of this um, run complete. I'm going to have to go through. There might be a few from the beginning I'm missing, but for the most part, I think I got them. Most all of them. We'll see. I really want to get the whole run. Jennifer Blood, number four, Perillo cover. 
She's also gotten into Carla Cohen's artwork, who is uh, Perillo's uh, significant other, and they both do amazing artwork. This one's Perillo's cover of Barbarella number six. And this is the Carla Cohen cover. They have a similar art style. Um, but I prefer Carla Cohen. She prefers Barilla. They're both great. House of Slaughter number three. Cover A. Sweet Paprika number six. I've looked at these, but I haven't read any of them yet. Uh, this is cover A of six. This is cover E. It's, uh, the erotic cover. I haven't opened it yet. I don't know what it looks like. Buffy the Last Slayer number one, uh, cover B. Buffy the Last Slayer. Number one, cover A again. So that's two. Joker, number ten. I'm missing a couple of these from Black Kate. Um, I can't remember which ones. But, uh, I'll go through the list I have on my phone eventually. And either get pick them up from the other place I go to or order them online. Usually when I order online, it's from Midtown or Graham Cracker. They both seem pretty good. Or at least they've treated me decent. Number 31, cover A of Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Berserker, number 6, cover B. Haven't read any of these ones yet. I do have a bunch of them. I just am so behind. Cover C. Berserker number six. Trello cover of Hell Sonya number one. Buffy the Last Vampire Slayer. Issue two. This one I'm interested in checking out. I haven't read a lot of Swamp Thing, but I'm liking the black labels I've read so far, so. This is uh, Swamp Thing Green Hell number one of three. Can't wait to check that out. Flash 777, um, cover A. Cover B. What about... I think I've read up to maybe 760 of the flashes. I'm still um, going through them. It's a slow process, but I am slow, so. Batman and Scooby Doo. I'm liking this series. I've read up to number 5 or 6, I think. This one's number 10. Shaggy Man meets Shaggy Man. Joker number 11. I think, uh, I haven't gotten, I think I ordered, well, I don't think, I know I ordered Joker number 9. Pretty sure that's one of the ones I don't have. That I never received from them, so. The Flash 778. Do we do 11? One more issue. One more issue. I, I don't think I ordered it yet, so it ha must not have been, um, it hasn't, the final order, cut off date, must not have happened yet, but I'm waiting, because that's the last one. And Joker number 12. Can't remember how many they said they were doing of the Joker, but I do remember it's ending soon. 
Now this. This came out in October. Finally got it last week. Finally. It took forever. And that is... Something is Killing the Children. Um, book one. It's the hardcover. And... I'm not sure if I'm going to open it and read it. Or try to get it electronically or what. I haven't read them. I've read some of the newer ones starting with, what was it, 17? But, yeah. I'll eventually check it out. So, that was my haul last week. And, until next time, I'll see you later.